I would like to say welcome to Laban Bajo guys and I hope that we are enjoy uh, during yeah. our trip to three days tonight around Komodo National Park and tomorrow we wanna see Komodo dragon and other animals in around Komodo National Park guys and uh, tomorrow also we would like to snorkeling uh, in around Komodo National Park and I think uh, tomorrow we are very lucky day with a uh, uh, guest from my Germany do uh, snorkeling around Komodo National Park and also trekking in, in around uh, Komodo National Park guys Quite hot. What yeah. are we all doing, fam? What, what, what's happening? Uh, we're gonna get some groceries, some bintang, bintang? some snacks. So did they say it's not enough? No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> bintang, Coca-Cola, all of this stuff. So we're out here at uh, just five minutes away from Siesta. We're gonna go buy some necessities and food that we can take on the boat for the next three days. So we're also here at an ATM so some of us can take some money out because after, after paying for that boat, we ran out of cash, literally. Payment, cash is king here. So we're gonna go buy some probably food too, you know, to take like snacks, more bin tanks, because I don't think there'll be enough bin tanks to last us three days. So uh, yeah, we did a little quick pit stop and then uh, we'll buy some food. ready we just go to our pickup now <laughs> and we get picked up bye they are already outside the hostel i think we're the last one so we have to run <laughs> that's hey. our guy What's yes name hi again? my name is daniel, daniel. Woo, welcome hey. to labon bajo let's, let's go. rock and roll together. Woo. yeah okay ladies and gentlemen Good afternoon, oh, gold guys. Good afternoon. Well, guys, uh, right now we are going to the harbor of Labon Bajo. Too much luggage. Too much luggage. So here we are at the boat, just transferring us right to the big boat. So this is the start of our boat trip. So looking forward to it. This is a boat. And the most exciting part of the day is finally boarding this boat that we have. And this is gonna be home for the next three days for us. Two nights, three days sailing around Komodo Island. It's gonna be pretty sick. We've done it before in 2019, but this one's gonna be a bit more different with the route. We will see Komodo Island itself, uh, see those dragons and stuff, so that'll be cool. So let the adventure begins. It's gonna be amazing. Here we go. I have a flashback because in 2019, Mark and I did actually a similar boat trip together here in Komodo <coughs> or Labuan Bacho around Komodo Island. And I'm so excited for the next three days where we will explore islands, go snorkeling, sea turtles, sea beds, maybe tonight. And yeah, it will be epic. And now I will show you where Mark and I will be sleeping. Let's go. We have a 
mirror as well got some view in there bed's really really low by the way it's like it's pretty low so you're pretty much on the ground but um yeah it's good it's really great so one thing i forgot to tell you guys is just like a little walkthrough of this boat so i'll start right at the bottom and show you guys uh show you guys pretty much what's down here okay show me what you got this, this, is, this is, is the door this is where you are which we always have some problems with I don't know. Uh, there we go. You, you have to be a bit stronger to uh, open the door. Huh? So this is a lovely little door, which actually is quite, wow, quite, quite um, nice and neat. There's a few things in it. Yeah. So that is we cool. We actually do have a, uh, a flower. A flower. <laughs> yeah. And one. we got also some Louis Vuitton. <laughs> Um, curtains, curtains yeah. yeah. So it's this is really for really four nice. people, huh? This is for six people. Six. I got a double bed. This one is a double bed as well. And ah. these are two single beds, which are actually a little bit, little bit bigger than a single bed. So That's perfect. Yeah. Uh, so over here, I don't know who's staying here, but there's only just two double beds. It's got a toilet there too. So that is cool. Cool. And then moving on to the last room. So the last room looks like this. You got a double bed and a double bed. So there it is. So there's about like three dorm rooms downstairs. One can fit like I guess six people if you share the double beds. And then there's one. I don't know how many rooms. There, I mean I don't know how many beds there are, but I would say there's three dorm rooms with uh, different bed sizes and stuff so uh, and that is, that's it, that's it I almost forgot to actually introduce you guys to the captain so let's go see him and see what he's got to say here eh? Hey captain, Hello. what's your name? My name is Matt Matt? Matt Mark? Yeah M-A-R-K? Yeah Oh, me too Mark Mark Mac Mac? Mac You're Mac? Matt, Mark Oh, Mark too Yeah, nice to meet you so one cool thing is the captain is called Mark, which means Mark is in charge. <laughs> so it's such a dry joke. <laughs> I guess I'll be laughing at my own joke later. So this is Danny guys. <laughs> yes, I'm Danny okay. from Labuan Bajo. I would like to say welcome to Labuan Bajo guys. And I hope that we are enjoying during yeah. our trip to three days tonight around Komodo National Park. And tomorrow we wanna see Komodo Dragon and other animals in around Komodo National Park guys. And uh, tomorrow also we would like to snorkeling uh, in around Komodo National Park. And I think uh, tomorrow we are very lucky day with a uh, uh, guest from my Germany do uh, snorkeling around Komodo National Park and also trekking in, in around uh, Komodo National Park guys so I would like uh, for you all guys please welcome please come to uh, our place Komodo National Park and the first come you come to Labon Bajo because Labon Bajo is the gateway uh, to Komodo National Park okay I waiting for you coming Labon Bajo guys Woo, oh, just... natural very natural that it was exactly one minute you should be on an ad <laughs> <laughs> hello guys <laughs> Mr. <Mini> Minico <laughs> <laughs> so the first island that we're going to is Kellogg's Island I think that's how you pronounce it and the boat has taken the first load of people so we're gonna go down now and we're gonna go check it out so we need some good shoes unfortunately I don't have my white shoes so we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna just wear that but uh, anyway this is the first stop so let's see what we have in store Guys, welcome to Keller Island. Keller Hello. Island, right? Hello, welcome yes. to Keller Island. What is your name, sir? Enzo Irbetifu, Keller Island. Okay, what's your name? Afri. Afri. So Afri is also a part of our trip, so any questions, we'll, we'll just ask him. So here we are at this island. Beautiful. 
and see what everyone is doing, eh? How's it going? Tough? Yeah. Well, I did not sign up for a hike. <laughs> but you gotta keep moving. It's always not that easy to be walking up when you're not prepared. Luckily, I look at the view from up here. See that? It's breathtaking. <laughs> I think it took my breath away. <laughs> Everybody, that was Keller Island for you guys. Yeah, be careful, mind your step. Anyhow, oh, there is a moment. Here is schon kalt. Yes, it is already cold, man. Here is already cold. Yes, it is And guys, dinner is served. Yeah, yeah. Not touch anything here on this table because it's so colorful and we are starting today. Thank you, Alex! Alex. <laughs> Very close, very close, and you can already see it behind me. Yeah. I've seen so many one. pictures, but still seeing it in real life, it's incredible, it's stunning. I think um, our guide just told us that if you want to take pictures, it looks better down there because then you can't see the crowd for sure. Not sure if we should go up there, you can even go higher up, but I'm not sure how it will look, if it's worth it. To sweat more. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> should we yeah. go up? Yes. Mm. Okay, let's go. So over here guys, you can see black sand, and then here is pink beach, pink sand. And then over there, which you can't see right now, <laughs> it's the white, white sand, white beach. So we going down and we're heading to Pink Beach and hopefully we will be one of the first ones <laughs> to arrive and I'm eating a Bang Bang which is quite popular here everyone loves it, it's really good This program is sponsored by Bang Bang <laughs> yeah. Any Bang Bang? Oh, Bang Bang! This one really makes me strong. Yeah. I used it on Pada Parhal. I used it on the Komodo Island. And I even used it on the diving spot, which I didn't do. really busy there's traffic and we have to wait because yeah traffic jam you know too Sorry. many people too i'm just annoying you <laughs> You got a coconut. Yeah, it's coconut really good. Drink because Guys, it's so hot. Yeah, you have to stay hydrated. <laughs> right. <laughs> nice.
nobody compares to you. We were here, but I must say it looks nicer right now because last time I think it was midday, so the sun was already like really up high. Now it's like and now it's really nice and that's so oh my god it's so clear <laughs> the water i mean look at it how cool <laughs> hey <laughs> and we met charlotte again <laughs> and miguel somewhere over there uh, the beach is literally thing with the corals here <laughs> I was stepping my first step on the pink beach and it feels crispy pink. <laughs> yeah. So I was feeling with my toes how pink it was and I was like, oh my gosh, this is pink. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, this guy's really David to her now, right? What? These guys that's are David, back. Right? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah. Back in the yeah, as I said, <laughs> yeah, we so could nice. like... the water. Yeah. Yeah. Almost the whole bridge. Oh, yeah. And here is our third stop for today. We are finally here air at Komodo Island. And uh, hopefully we see some Komodo because apparently they're afraid of humans. So. You think we see Komodo today? Yes. Hello. You think we see Komodo today? Yeah, but I don't guarantee to like to see Komodo dragon, but depend on how lucky we are today. <laughs> how do you make them come? Hello? You know? How do we invite them? Uh, I will call them later. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty smart to have an umbrella. Here we are. Welcome to Komodo National Park. Welcome guys to Komodo National Park, which are in Komodo Island. Yeah. <laughs> so right now we are in the ranger station. Watch out, Komodo. Yeah, what? <laughs> so if you guys don't know, Komodo Island is actually an island famous for Komodo dragons. And if you don't know what they are, they're like the largest lizard living on this planet. Um, but yeah, hopefully we see some today. Apparently they're usually try they hide themselves away from humans just because there's so much of us here. So they're all a bit outnumbered, but they're massive. But they're a massive reptile. If you don't know what they look like, this is just a little statue. Oh well. It looks like bigger than the original size. So that's what a Komodo dragon usually looks like. <laughs> and again, this is our second time. Me and Karina did this trip back in 2019. I know I said it plenty of times, but I just want to let you guys know because I know what to expect, but I'm so, so eager to learn more about them. So from what I've heard is that female Komodo dragons can lay up to about 24 eggs during their breeding season. And a healthy, healthy female Komodo dragon could possibly also lay up about 36 eggs in one season. And I think the, the season is uh, February to April from what I've seen but um, I'll need to check a bit more facts because there's so much more about that I don't know about them so yeah so just bear in mind there is an entrance fee when you come here usually not included with your boat trip <laughs> or maybe double check with them but there seems to be a lot of people so um, we're just waiting to get the tickets so that we can get our tour guide to show us around the national park so pretty exciting I think we found one, but it's already with uh, another group. Over here. Okay, guys. Okay, thank you. Okay, follow me. Follow the ranger. So this is the first uh, Komodo one we've seen. It's about a medium sized one. So here's another one, about medium size. Yes, I think like that. Yeah, look at that. Okay, I'm going to go there. 
How, how long how long do they live? How long? How many years? They can live until uh, 50 years old. 50 years old, human years, huh? Yeah, I think like seems like human. Wow. <laughs> how come they don't stay together? They always one by one. Yeah. They uh, have a they like to be alone? Animal. They don't live together. Ah, that's very lonely life. We just got back from Komodo Island, saw about four, four of them. Uh, so one deer, two wild pigs. That's insane. So it's good to be able to see them. Most of the uh, most of the dragons or Komodo dragons we saw was actually quite medium sized, they're quite small compared to what we saw in 2019. But no comparison at all. It's still an experience, and just to remember, the entrance fee is 120k to get into Komodo Island. So, the boys are just uh, taking the anchor out of the <laughs> out of the bottom of the sea, and this is uh, how you manually do it. Working together. Yeah. Okay, guys. So everybody's pretty much knocked out, uh, having a nap. After Komodo Island, we had lunch and then now we are pretty much here already. Uh, this is called Takama... Takama Sar? Sounds like... Sounds like... Sounds like a food. <laughs> Takama Kasar. I think that's what it, how you say. It's a sandbar and it's literally right in front of me already. Look at this. Cloudy, that's why I look really dark. That's better. <laughs> the sun <laughs> facing me. But yeah, so there are a few clouds, otherwise, it would be blue as water. Whoa, and I'm falling <laughs> because I'm vlogging <laughs> and I'm not looking where I'm going. Yeah, you can. Covered a little snorkel spot, little coral here, where you can see some blue and black fish. And yeah, it's cool because you can still stand, so it's easy to see them. And the water is so clear, so it's even easier to see them. It's literally the evening right now. We are about to have dinner and literally like watching everyone just spending some time on the deck watching the sunset together has been pretty amazing to basically end our final night because tomorrow is our I think tomorrow is going to be our half a day before we head back to Labo and Bacho. So actually we'll be dropped we're actually uh, being dropped off to Pirate Island so while the rest of the team will be going back to Labo Mbacho. So this is our last dinner tonight. The camera is right there. And this program is sponsored by Bang Bang. <laughs> <laughs> 
Such a simple uh, dinner. <laughs> Literally rice, some soup, and chicken. <laughs> That's basically what I'm having for dinner tonight. Chicken, prawns, mushroom, prawns, yeah, prawns. And good morning. I said good morning to these guys. Yeah, rise and shine for our last and final day here for the boat crew. Yes. And today, or well, this morning, this mission is we're going to be snorkeling pretty much most of the morning. Uh, we are stopping by here first at this spot to do some snorkeling and hopefully see, see, uh, see some manta rays. There are literally no boats around. We are the only ones, so the chances of seeing a manta ray is much higher because they don't have to run away from people. <laughs> or swim away um, and then we'll have breakfast and then after breakfast we'll go back to snorkeling again so and then we'll be also going to a place called Kanewa Kanewa Island I think that's what they call it we've, we've been there before so we get to check it out again so without stopping by let's start the day right now professional sunscreen applier yeah. <laughs> Professional massager. <laughs> <laughs> professional shoe messer. <laughs> <laughs> I love professionals on board. Let's go! Monterey, we are coming. So I hope we can uh, see a lot of Monterey. <laughs>
just finished snorkeling and now we're just chilling in the water again. It's our favorite thing to do, I think. <laughs> and we are in Kinawa Island. Yes, the water is so clear. Amazing, look. You can even see my feet. Everything. So the trip of uh, Komodo, uh, three days, two nights have come to an end, back at Labuan Bacho. What do you got to say? Are you going to miss us? Uh, thank you so much. All of my clients already visited here in Labuan Bajo and around Komodo National Park. Okay. I would like to say again thank you so much. Later. I hope you enjoy your trip during uh, in Labuan Bajo and around Komodo National Park during three days tonight uh, around Komodo National Park with our local food and bar here. So guys, for all of you are uh, waiting in Labuan Bajo, I hope you can come in come to Labon Bajo and then you can do a trip three days tonight around Kumbu National Park so you can enjoy also the beautiful in Labon Bajo and around and uh, we hopefully also yeah please promotion about our uh, place uh, Labon Bajo and Kumbu National Park as well to your friend family or in your uh, a company in your or in your country, I mean, so, <laughs> so please promise me. We need yeah, it. We promise. Yeah, we yeah. Promise. Thank you. <laughs> we need, we need your helping. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, guys. It's not uh, over. Yeah. yeah. It's our turn to talk now. I want to say thank you, Danny. We enjoyed our time. You were the perfect guide. We thank had you. so much fun. And this is from all of us. Oh, thank you so much. Thank and then so I will. Uh, Share, share to my crew. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was really a pleasure. Yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. Oh, uh, thank you. Thank you to everyone. Thank, thank you. you. See you. <laughs> so, back at Labuan Bacho here at the pier, we just basically fared well and said uh, bye to some of the crew that we've had for the last three days that we've spent. We uh, say goodbye to Rob, he's going his own way. You may see him a bit later in Bali if he's around. Also the crew are going back to Siesta. That's where we're go they're going to go back for I think a night. And then they're also splitting ways um, with let's say David going to Thailand and Vietnam and the other two are going to be heading to Changu and Uluwatu. So we might see them too. So. And same with Sasha as well, he's going to be floating around Uluwatu, Changu. So there's a ch high chance that we'll see some of them back in Bali. But right now we're waiting for our boat, which is going to take us to Pirate Island. I have done no research at all. It's all Karina that has booked this, so I have no uh, idea where we're going to be going. So it's going to be a big uh, imp impression. I heard it's really, really good. <laughs> it's, uh, I've uh, been told that it's uh, really an amazing time, it's a good place to go to, so let's see where where it is and what it is, and we'll find out soon. So literally after arriving, here we are, 10 minutes after, about to jump on a board, <laughs> a board, jump on a boat, it's going to cost us 100k for the both of us.